out here in the mountains, as uh, we can see. It's been a beautiful ride this morning, kind of watching the sun come up. Uh, it's gonna come up over this ridge over here, here in a little bit, getting closer, but. So I have been riding down, coming up this wash for quite a while. It's been a kind of a challenging experience on this bike, but it's doing good. So today I just wanna kind of go for a simple ride and just kind of have a, kind of take me back to the roots of what motorcycle riding is for me. And it's just kind of getting out on the bike, getting out into a beautiful place. I'm gonna have a cup of coffee somewhere in the mountains. Um, I made like a little, I got a little portable coffee maker that I'm gonna give it a try today. And uh, just do some hiking and uh, just kind of enjoy the simple life. Man, I'm not gonna lie, that was a fun trail. Definitely pushing the bike. Uh, just a beautiful morning though, just an awesome way to start the day. And uh, man, it's just a really beautiful feeling. I really have no destination. Just uh, living the simple life, going for a ride. And uh, time to get up in the mountains a little more, maybe find some places to hike around. Let's keep it going. So I found this cool, really cool looking little uh, cave. It looks like it, I've been bored out by the water over a lot of years, I don't know. But uh, pretty nice and cool in here. It's getting a little hot on the bike, so man, it feels great. And uh, I think I'm gonna hike in there a little bit. My shoes, I'm gonna test my shoes. I got some uh, kind of hiking riding boots. They're supposed to be waterproof, so uh, we'll see what happens. It's good to know my uh, shoes are waterproof. That's kind of nice. I used to uh, ride in cowboy boots, but uh, it was always kind of a pain in the ass because I had to carry hiking shoes as well. I like the uh, the protection with the boots, but now I just kind of got these like, I think they're technically hunting hiking boots, um, but they're waterproof, great for hiking, decent protection on the bike. So I don't know if there's a best all around shoe, but it's kind of nice.
really cool overlook. It's really windy. Uh, a little over 10,000 feet up here. Beautiful views in uh, all directions. And, uh, ready to get down more into the valleys and keep exploring. just been an absolute blast so far riding been off road for a little while uh, heading over to check out a really cool reservoir just a beautiful end of summer day to be on the motorcycle um, I've realized looking at this helmet <laughs> realizing that right now it kind of looks like shredders helmet from Ninja Turtles I don't know if I could find a photo of that maybe put it right here I don't know I look like shredder from a uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. But uh, having a great ride, it's just always amazing to be out in nature, be on the bike. So I guess in this area a few years ago, there was a pretty large fire, sadly, and uh, I believe it was man-made as well as told. And a guy was out front of his cabin and using one of those weed torches and started a fire and couldn't get it out. And it ended up just burning down just massive amounts of these mountain ranges as you can see I don't know if you can tell behind me but basically every tree in these in the background has just been burned it's slowly coming back it's probably good for the soil I don't uh, the soil kind of gets better nutrients and everything from the fire but sadly it'll probably never come back at all in any way in our lifetime and it's just one of those things that happen but just a amazing day Bike's running great, I'm getting low on gas, so I do need to uh, find a gas station at some point. But uh, I don't want to go back to civilization, just having a great time out here. <laughs> pretty deep in the mountains now just having an amazing time uh, I got this little river crossing here kind of checking it out the beginning parts pretty deep but I want to see what's up this road and uh, explore 
I like to get lost in the mountains and kind of go in the areas that most people don't go. So it's always a little scary when you're way out here, there's nobody around. So I think I'll be good. And this is kind of part of the adventure. If anything, I'll just put on a little show for these cows over here and they can laugh at me if I fall in. And uh, we'll keep it going. So I've just been on this incredible, beautiful little highway road, just up in these canyons. It's uh, just a dream for a motorcycle. It's just windy and beautiful views in every direction. Just an incredible day. It's definitely warming up a little bit, but it's been a little overcast and nice. So I'm just looking for a good spot to kind of chill and have a cup of coffee. kind of one of those moments that you just have to take in and enjoy you know this is just the, the beautiful moments of being an adventure rider being out in nature and hiking around and having this incredible area to yourself on this day grateful to be alive and have a great nice cup of coffee just chilling on this beautiful kind of an end of summer day and just trying to take it all in you know grow as a human grateful to be alive and on my bike today it was just always, this has always been something and anybody that probably watches this would agree of, it's just really important to get this time out. I generally think it's important to do it by yourself, not with other people. You really can't grow in a lot of ways when you're kind of being influenced and you're around other people. I just love being on my bike and being out alone and, and getting this time to kind of reflect and plan out my week and just kind of be in one in nature. So, just uh, really grateful for this experience. Just hang out for a little bit and journal and finish my coffee and keep the adventure going for a little while and just enjoy what this is. just about ran out of gas so that gets a little scary I was on top of the mountain and uh, only had a couple little notches left on the on the gas tank meter and uh, I'll cruise all downhill <laughs> so whew, sometimes I can get a little scary when you uh, when you uh, don't realize it could get real real quick mm -hmm. 